The words of this life with Apostle Grace Lubega. If you are a dedicated reader of the Bible, I'm talking of people who take time to invest in the Word, who have deliberately created time to invest in the Word, who can go and read through the Bible, want to know the whole story. If you don't function in the place of revelation, you cannot see God. God is visible in the places where there is revelation. The reason why sometimes we want to push you people to read the Word and study the Word so intimately is that God might become revelational to you personally that by the time we come to preach the gospel he is evidently revealed to you when a man stays on that word for long there is something that happens there will always be a difference between somebody who tarries around the word of God and gives God time to pray and seek his face than somebody who isn't because every time you're speaking in tongues you're up to something every time you're praying you're up to something every time you yield your spirit to God you're up to something if you fill yourself with the spirit and you yield and submit to the working of the spirit for so long what happens to your eyes they start to reflect the effect of the spirit to which you yield because your eyes they're the light of the white body there is something about your eyes physical spiritual when you are around whatever you yield to okay the bible says that give yourself holy to these things holy not partially give yourself holy to them that thy profiting the bible says may appear to all when a man gives themselves holy to the word your profiting appears to all you don't even need to say i profit you don't even need to give testimonies of profit you don't even need to speak about yourself how you profit no people will look at you and they'll start to realize that there is profit on this guy there is profit on this woman there is just something different about her but you see we're living in a generation that has not learned to give themselves holy to these things fully sometimes you have to take salvation a bit more serious if you are also serious about growing in god the shortcut is the one this is why people get born again people get born again because there's a life and it is eternal life to know the one true god and his only son jesus that's our primary mandate as believers to know god and the one true son not to know what's bewitched us no to know god not to know which date our promotion will come it's important but it's not our primary mandate why because the word of god the bible says he's a shackle and a double-edged sword it cuts asunder separate the bone and marrow exposes our hearts and those who are they really are but you see the next line says that nothing is hid before him that means if you have the word of god in your spirit before i even tell you that you're getting promoted next week you'll feel it in his presence with Fenero ministries international this 31st december 2017 at the lugogo cricket oval from 6 p.m a night of open heavens prophecies signs miracles and wonders Fenero, make manifest